Pat Biz, a regional agronomist with 360 Yield Center here today, out in my favorite favorite office in the fall, uh, picking some corn. So I wanted to point out for those Nebraska fans out there that I'm wearing my Illinois jacket with pride after a number of years of drought of beating Nebraska. Now we can say that we've done it. So with that, a little harvest update from the cab. So we're uh, fortunately finished up beans. We've had a really great run of weather. And uh, as a result, finished up beans as early as we've ever done it. And the corn has dried down more so um, than I've seen it in past years. So with that, we are working to, to get a corn harvested before it gets any drier. Right now, this field's averaging just under 19%. Don't really want it any drier uh, just because we're going to get more head shell. So we're running chain roll on the head right now uh, in an effort to size the residue and prepare the field a little bit more for next year. So one of the other things about this field is it did get a late application of Y drop last summer. Uh, and we, we took the advantage of coming in late to add another 30 pounds to the, to the rate that we were going to use originally make up for some of the some of the nitrogen we lost with 15 inches of rain. A couple of other things, so so yields are very good, uh, especially compared to the areas in the field where we left without that application just to see what, uh, what, what, what kind of good we were doing. The other note that we have to make on, on those late wide drop applications though is that we have some uh, some ruts from the sprayer that we got to fill in. So typically I would not till this field, I would just uh, maybe run turbo till across or strip till it. Uh, this one's going to need to be chisel plowed in order to fill in some of the some of the drama tracks that we have going on in, in the field. So uh, with that, I hope everybody stays safe and we'll catch up with you later. Thank you.